a little exclusive. I've removed the red. Oh, we've got the police behind me. You haven't even done anything wrong. And he's just had his baby. No pressure, guys. Isn't that suddenly? It's really hot. <laughs> Keep it professional, mate. Time to sell the car and get a cheaper car. Are you gonna hit my car? Oh. oh my god, look what's in our garden. Oh. Happy Father's Day. No, don't say that. Ah. You were supposed to book New Southgate. That's a rags to riches story. This is a different animal. It's always something that I do. If I borrow someone's car, the least I can do is fill it up. Audi, Lamborghini, same thing. This is the brand new Cullinan done by Urban. I hate it. I really don't like it. I need to do better things. It's gonna be hit and miss. Going up so much now. <laughs> Hi guys, it is Yanni, and this is episode four of Yanni Monthly. Enjoy. So it's Friday afternoon, and like I get like a bellara, which is like a craziness in Greek, where things just like get to me. And I feel, oh, you know what? Let me just try something different. So I've removed the red off the arch. So obviously, we've got the forged carbon there, and I removed the chrome red off. But now. Obviously with the gloss black, it don't really work, does it? But I do have another set of Vossens here. So, and they're black. So Andy's taken off the white one and we're gonna try and put the black one on and see how that works. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm feeling or what I'm doing. I don't even know if I'm gonna keep the red. It's just that, yeah. So let's put the black one on for now and see what happens. Um, all right, so I took over whilst Jan's on the phone, but Andy is putting the first wheel on. What do you think, Andy? Now I kind of like the white wheels. Now I've got used to it. It looks weird seeing black wheels again. So that's the smaller rim with a thicker tire in black. This side we've got bigger rim, smaller tire in white. The black looks good, but the wheel just looks tiny now, man. It looks like if I was to put on Dion's shoes. <laughs> <laughs> what are we saying? Yeah, put the white wheel back on. I don't like it. <laughs> that so. Yeah. How small does that look like? That's what I see. It's black. Yeah, knock it off. So sometimes you get bored of your trim. So look, my hair's quite long. I'm just going to shave it off. Yeah, I did a thing. It's Britney King. And just like that. Hi guys, it's Yanni from Yanomize and welcome back to this week at Yanomize episode 88. So whilst I was filming T-Way, this guy randomly appears out of a Tesla. You all right? My name's Josh Horace. Good to meet you. Hi Josh, pleased to meet you. You look like a very smart work experience kid. So actually a full-time mystifier. Full-time mystifier, yeah? Okay then, let's see it. We're going to try something just with a piece of paper. Three, two, I'll take, what? I'll take that. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> okay, that was quite impressive. But I've actually got work to do. It's time to go home now. There's another one that's okay. Well, okay, write your name on it quick. Write my name on it. This one will. I'll do I ain't gonna lie. I, I love Josh. But you know when someone just doesn't go home now? No, it's like we spent too much time in now and no. I've got stuff to do. No. Go on, Josh. Look, after what I'm gonna do now, hopefully. Hopefully, you won't have that disappointment. What I'd love you to do is disappear. All right, cool. you ready, yeah? You see the ripped up piece of paper? Yeah. Yeah? I also have the box, yeah? Yeah. So just this green post-it note I picked up. Just watch closely, with random letters on it. You see the box? Focus. Three, two, one. As it now says, the animize is the best. This guy, mystifiers. Are you a mystifier? A mystifier. He's a mystifier, stroke musician, magician. Definitely not a musician. <laughs> I'm so tired, and it's like half twelve. Okay. Anyway, we'll do the last one then. Anyway, have you got the? Uh... Here you go, mate. <laughs> All right. Cool. This is definitely the last one. This is definitely well. Show the signature to everyone. Stuff so famous. Okay, and I've also got a lighter. And a kiwi. Yeah, a bit random, but anyone like kiwis? Or? Uh, okay, and your pin number? <laughs> You're right, mate. I'm joking. <laughs> nothing in my hands, nothing. These notes are a bit difficult to fold. Three, two. <laughs> he turned to a fiver. <laughs> it slowly turns into a five pound note, so. 
There we go. Am I going to cut the kiwi with the money inside? I'm not that good. Um, we're going to do a deal. Okay. If anyone can guess how many seeds are inside the kiwi, I'll give you back the note. That's the only way you're going to get it back. So, how many would you say? It's from 100 to 1,000, so what do you think? 400. What do you think? 150. I should have a knife on me, a bit dodgy, ah. but you count the seeds on the table in one moment. Take it out. If that has your name on it, you're going to clap. You're going to go absolutely crazy. You've been holding it the whole time. Is That's it? it. Hey. That's it. Well That's anyway, quite sick. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> That's wow. very good. But, uh, yeah, no. Be so nice. Yeah, I'll do it now. Can you finish? Yeah, you can put your hands on the side all night if you want to get it off. Um, all right, I'll get my stuff together. I'll we'll go to the other picture. All right, legend. Thank you. Well done. Thanks, mate. <laughs> so this is where I am right now. Grange Land Rover Jaguar. There's my Urus. So by the time you're watching this, there'll already be a video out. If you click here, you can see that. We've done a full video on this, but this is actually before we even shot the video, because I'm not actually collecting this car until a couple of days time. But Taryn, who's the manager here, said to me, Jan, do you want to come and see it quickly? So I'm going to come and see this car now. And there she is for the first time. That is my brand new, Range Rover. Got 23 inch wheels. It is brand new box fresh and this is the first one coming out of Grange Range Rover. As I said, there's a full video on this out now on the Yanomize YouTube channel. There's the mileage. I always say, what if it's got less than 40? It's not new, but yeah. Thought I'd give you a little exclusive. So the guys at Grange were fantastic. Customer service was amazing and they even got myself and my family some gifts. <laughs> a little lamb over bear. Oh, my daughter's gonna love that. Like he's in like in his like in his overalls as well. My daughter will love that. Something for Steph. That's uh, something for Steph for the wife. Clever in it. Yeah, she'll she'll love this. Mate, that's so kind, honestly. That's so kind. Thank you so much. That's that's so kind. Look at that. That's for Steph, thank you so much. That's so kind. She likes flowers. So after my gifts, Nico got his own little gift from his wife. Oh, Nico, he, Nico had the baby. So while I'm here, Nico's just sent me a picture and he's just had his baby, look. He's had another boy, that's his second boy. Ah, oh. yes, Nico. Congratulations to you and Crystal, bro. Oh man, I'm so happy for you. Well done, well done, well done. Hope everything went well. Oh man. So it's time to head back now, but I had one problem. I actually turned up in my Urus and I wanted to take my Range Rover home. So I needed someone to drive the Urus. But one guy came to mind. Gussie. Hello. Hello. If you don't know who Gussie is, he is levels. He's definitely the Stig of the videographers, the Michael Schumacher of the edits. He's even cooler than an ice cube. So he was the man I trusted to drive my car. This guy eats pressure for breakfast. Are you cool? Yeah. yeah. No pressure, Gus. No pressure, Gus. <laughs> Lots of pressure. <sighs> Let's get the AC on in here, because uh, suddenly it's really hot. Look, look, just look what automatically happened. I literally went like this. I never do that. Yeah. But just see Yan do it in his cars. It's policy. Ah, oh, Gussie. You've got to love Gus. He drives a nice, brand new VW T Rock. So I wonder how the pressure was driving my Lamborghini Urus. So this just feels like it's doing a lot more for a lot less. As in I've got my foot down and it's like ah! yeah. my car will be like Yeah. They are running for their lives towards yeah. this car. You know what they said? They were like, oh my god, is that Gus? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Get used to it man. So yeah. <laughs> Been driving this Lambo for probably about three, four minutes. Tell you what, it's not a button. But that helps. Because <laughs> you know. Yeah, yeah. Driving the Urus. 
Yeah. Yo. I made it. Is there, is there something there? Oh, Look at that. Oh. You know you got that. Did you get that? Yeah. Oh my god, I can't see people with everything. <laughs> what car first? Uh, we'll do in the, in the cab first, yeah. So if you don't know who this is, this is Crazy Ginger Cabby, and we shot some content together. He's actually a black cabby, stand-up comedian, and social media personality. He's actually hilarious, but not very PG, so be warned when you look at his content. I look like a fat Conor McGregor, don't I? <laughs> What's your name, mate? Mark. That's a nice name. Can I call you Craig for the evening? Sorry? Mark with a C. Mark with But one thing he always is, professional. <laughs> Keep it professional, mate. that for me John you cheeky hey John do you know where you're going mate so I've had the car for less than 24 hours there she is she's heading to urban Needs to be colour coded, wheels, looking at the kit, and then she's going to be wrapped. Still got 36 miles on it, picked up on 25 and 11 miles. I just need to decide what colour. Let's head up to Urban, let's get the wheels on, it's going to have 24 inch wheels. So, yeah, it will be changed up, so we're going to do. Obviously, we're going to get rid of all the greys. But the wheels come in, so some bits will get done here, some bits will get done at Yanomice, and then obviously it needs the wrap. And my private plate needs to go on as well. So, I've left my car at Urban, obviously I need to get back. So, who'd you call? Ginger Cabby, number two. <laughs> Lenny. Lenny the Geezer's dropping me back. He's got to go and shoot. Um, he's going to a, no, 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 a video. I can't say, yeah, I can't say, yeah, I can't say, yeah. where. Secret. He's doing something to do with TV, not him, but the car, so we can't say for what show. Um, so he's heading down to Ali Pali. So while he's heading down, they might as well drop me off. Yeah. Nice, yeah. so I get a nice lift back in a lovely Defender. I still need to decide a colour. What colour? I know, I know what colour you should do. Go on, tell me the colour. How am I going to tell you what we, what we were talking about? Tell me the colour. Yellow. You think yellow? I think, bro, I, I think layer cake vibes, 2022 Range Raver. The new Duke. The new Duke. What do we think? Yeah? Yellow, it's a gloss black roof, black wheels. Welcome to the layer cake, son. <laughs> let me know what you think. Comment down below, let me know what you think. Um, I'm going to think about it. Still don't know. Satin black's obviously the obvious one, which look great, but boring. <sighs> Sorry, I was just, that's just okay. a white on white with the white wheels. Um, I like that. Or chrome. A bit of chrome. Is that too, too Larry for you? Lenny always has his cars black. Everything's always black and his wheels are if black. If I could go darker, I'd go darker than black. If they made a darker colour than black, <laughs> you'd do it. Let's see. So I've filled up my car a lot of times, right? A lot of times. 420 miles. It took 163 pounds and 13 pence. What? The most I've ever put in is about 145, 146. <laughs> crazy, absolutely crazy. Time to sell the car and get a cheaper car, I think. Smart car is coming. So when you arrive, and you're waiting for Daniel. Usually he's quite punctual, but he's late. So he's 20 minutes late now. Oh, look, 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 here he comes. Look at him. Here he comes in his own time. Look. 
You're late. You are half an hour late to the Tyson Fury fight. Don't try it. <laughs> His car's quite clean as well. What makes a change? I look and copy my haircuts. <laughs> It's, it's, it's the shave sport, heads. Yeah. Hey, how are you gonna get out of the car, bro? You thought about that? I'm lost weight back in my car. Just go a bit further over. You got a tiny little car, man. Bro, keep going, man. You get a bus in there. You drive HGV. You can't drive a little defender. Oh, this is gonna be good. You're gonna hit my car. Bang. Got him. You know what? You want the content that bad? You, you prefer me to damage the car. I actually really don't. <laughs> You ain't getting out. It's tight, bro. <laughs> oh my god, you got your DJ as well, yeah? You're just gonna put everything on the roof. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna make you thinner, but okay. I'm getting out of this car. Success! <laughs> like up. Hello. Hello. Time to water the garden. Looking so good now. Okay, who's enjoying the sun? tired I've been doing this for like 10-15 minutes. Ooh. Oh easy easy careful slow down slow down boy all right have some water right, who's it here here who's it here good boy Cool guy, but um, yeah, you gotta do something though to keep it clean till he comes. Uh, yes, it's only a small pool, um, but obviously the pool guy needs to come and do his thing. These will be going soon. So I've got Manny from Elite Pave and Shebang coming to put the pool cover down. Yeah, it's, listen, the pool will do its job. It's nice, the sun shining. Oh my God, look what's in our garden. What on earth is this bird doing in my garden? So random. So another day, I'm out and about, I'm with Sai today. i um, got a few little bits to do today. So I'm heading to VW to order Barish's polo. He won on the Animals competition. You can see a little bit of that on the screen right now. No way, no way, yes! From there, I'm heading over to my friend's house to pick up his Pagani Wire. <laughs> so you might remember the Pagani Wire we done a stripe when it was on the Yanomai's, um, Yanni Supercar Customizer TV show. This time, jaws drop as an ultra rare million pound hypercar arrives. Let's be honest, best car we've ever had 100%. here. 100%. Yeah. 100%. 100% hands down this is the one so I need to collect that because we're shooting content for the Yanomai's anthem the song that we've got coming out and then not only am I collecting that I'm bringing that to Yanomai's I'll have that for the day and then I've got um, a certain Matt Watson coming I don't know who he is he's the guy from Carwa that I shoot all the drag races with you know I invented the drag race hey, wait, 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 wait. I'm not ready! He's coming to Yanomai's for something that I can't really say because this video will come out before that video. So you'll see it on next Yanni Monthly, but yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be cool. So we don't know which one it is. I do, I do know which one it is. Hold on two seconds. It's the Finchley Road one. So yeah, we actually got the wrong location. But we got there in the end. 
No, don't say that. I am going to have to say that. That's miles away. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I thought... So I thought you were going to the new Southgate Yeah, one. that's what I thought. That's where I'm heading yeah. towards. But I don't think that's the one that Bav called. 277 Finchley Road, NW3. Bav. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I think he... The, I don't know what happened, to be honest. Um, yeah. Is this how you know it's not fixed? It's, even we're going to the wrong place. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know it's real when we don't even know what we're doing. Anyway, we're heading to the right dealer now, so we'll get there. Hello, mate. You're a boy, you are. You know that. Go on. I'm sending you to a different location tomorrow, mate. You were supposed to book New Southgate. So where's she booked it? You, she, she, it's you. She told me you booked it. You booked Finchley Road. No, she's supposed. To speak to them. <laughs> She's blaming you, Bav. Oh, Just so right. tomorrow tomorrow we're in Southampton, yeah? Just so you know from me. Yeah, cool. All right. <laughs> See you later. See you later. Bye. Because it's Fuzz's nap time, so I might as well. Yeah, just take her. That's fine. He's got, he's got my number anyway. Yeah? All right. Okay. Oh, cool. All right, Fuzz. All right, bye. Why did you call her Fuzz? Steph. Steph likes cats, even though we've got the biggest dog. And like the, the cat's got furs, it's just it's just a nickname furs. So we used to call each other furs, and then we call the baby furs. So just everyone's furs. The issue I've got is now my daughter is Leah Marie. When someone says to me, What's your daughter's name? I have to, I'm like, uh, and they look at me like, You don't know your daughter's name? Because I, I just call her furs all the time. You actually forget. Um, so I'm starting to try to call her by her name now. But yeah, she doesn't turn around. She doesn't even know who Leah Marie is, my baby. <laughs> if I call her furs, she's like, Yeah. I say Leah Marie, she's like, Yeah, whoever, I don't know who that is. Barish is a real, real lovely guy and another great winner for Yanomite's competitions. It's exciting, huh? That's honestly, that's exciting it to is. win a prize like this. Yeah. I thought he was joking first, didn't I? I remember I told you, I thought it was April Fools or something. We'll send you the video yeah, so you can watch it, but it's yeah. hilarious because he's he was like this. No way. No way. No way. I can't believe it, man. No way, you're a legend. JJ, thank you so much Pleasure. for your help. Pleasure. We appreciate Pleasure. it. So it was time to move to our next destination. But if you haven't already signed up to yanomizecomps.com, do it right now. You could be our next winner. So I've got two friends, Ven and VJ. We, we go back many, many moons. I used to drive a BMW 3 Series when I was about 18. And Ven used to drive a, um, used to drive a Corsa. Um, <laughs> And now he's got a Pagani, 918, and every other car you can possibly imagine. So it's, it's insane, absolutely insane. But if you click here, you can actually see the video of the Pagani um, and when we wrapped it and who the guys are. And yeah, I've said to them, listen, I need to borrow the car. And they're like, no problem, Yanni, just come to my house and grab it. Which is, it's cool. It's, it's nice to have friends like that, that trust you, that you can just go pick up a two million pound car. Just, yeah, just come pick up, Yanni, no problem. So just picked up the Pagani wire up from VJ. As you can see, he's got his SV. We wrapped this in the Marbeck colors. Uh, you might remember it done like a digital print on this. And then obviously he's got his 918 spider there as well. This is like the man cave and it goes all the way down. Okay, and then he's got his LFA down there and he's got his Toyota. He loves a Toyota Supra as well. The area he lives in, it's not really, don't really get parking spaces. So to be able to be able to put three cars there, four, five, six, seven, you can probably put seven cars in here plus four in his driveway. I just got to laugh. You got to laugh. This is level. You know, when you come, you feel inspired. When I come to places like this, I'm like, I need to work harder. I need, I need, to, I need to do better things. But I said, I know where they came from. And when they came from a little chicken shop in Hendon, driving a Vauxhall Corsa, that's a rags to riches story, for real. Get on the playground. Yeah. So many bags on me. You would have thought I was a spray ground. Now they know I don't play around. I can hear what you're saying now. I just doubled up my flight miles. Coast to coast, no, they ain't in town. I get rich, watch, then I get a sick watch. Watch me hit the top. I might make a tick tock. Left hand, right hand. Bro, I'll speak to you later, yeah? Alright, bro, see you later. You know, when you drive someone else's car, 
Listen, driving Lambos and Ferraris and Porsches and Bentleys, yeah, that's no problem. Driving this is a different animal. It was really low on fuel, and it's at the end of the day, he's done me the favour. So the least I can do is fill it up for him. So let's see how much it takes to fill up a Pagani. I don't know how big a tank this will have, so I can't expect it to be that much. 100 pounds, maybe? Oh! -ho -ho! 90 pounds, that's it. Not bad, I'll take that, that's, that's cheap. The problem is, uh, by the time I get back to the animals, I need to fill it back up again. It's always something that I do. If I borrow someone's car, the least I can do is fill it up and get the car clean for them as, as a thank you. You gotta remember, listen, to, to hire this, it would probably cost me two grand for the day. It's, it's ridiculous. Um, so yeah, just little things, appreciation. But yes, yeah, got a full tank now. We'll head back to the animals and um, shoot some content. Yeah. Pagani, oh, yeah. and then at the bottom you've got the L, uh, LFA that's and the Supra. Yeah. But his Supra is so meaty, food off it. Yeah, Lambos are cool and all, but this is just different, next level. Different cat in the fish. This is something else, bro. This is what you call class. Down to the screws, everything, all handmade. Let's do a proper car. Proper car. Good. So we've got the police behind me. Uh, they're pulling me over. You haven't even done anything wrong. Oh yeah. Wow, it's very quick. Um, Don't get bored of being pulled over. Pull the pins. Constantly ripping them off. You must, must, even the YouTube videos and all stuff. You must get bored of it. So this happens. The police were doing this good cop, bad cop thing. One of them was really, really cool, really, really understanding, and the other one was like, "No, give me a driving license." And I was like, "Okay, give me a chance to get out of the car." And then he started accusing me of selling my cars with tints. It, it was just madness, like crazy. You usually get coppers, they're just like, cool, no problem, yeah, and just peel the tints off. This one is very happy to do me today, isn't he? Do you know what? I always say that to people. People always say to me, in real life, it's so much better. And then we had the real cool police officer who was actually really, really nice. He said he watches my videos. But it was just a bit bizarre that one officer wanted to do me as much as possible. And the other one was talking about my YouTube videos and my weight loss. Very, very strange. That's not good for the window whatsoever. So yeah, got pulled over, um, number plates, a fine for my number plates and my tints. And um, yeah, so we we'll removed the tints off. You know what's weird is, he actually wasn't going to come this way. I was going to go another way and I was like, oh, I don't know, we'll take the scenic route. Yeah, and what's weird is always around this area, North Circular, Brent Cross area, Staples Corner area, what we've done before with my Range Rover, I got done. It's always this sort of area, there's always this new traffic police around here. Anyway, remove them, they're off the window, listen to this. Yeah, happy Father's Day. Glue remover, blade, to get it off. This is my boy Jimmy. Yes, Jamie and Wembley, so this is the car wash. Preston Road car wash. I used to pretty much live at back in the day. So it's 7 a.m. and I've just been picked up by Mr. Sai. Um, hello. We are heading to Urban today to pick up my range. It's had its bits done. Picking it up and bringing it back to Yanomai's um, to be wrapped. So yeah, I've had the car about a week now and we've already changed the wheels, tinted it, so I 
side steps, just needs the wrap. And the wrap I've chose is um, it's different. It's out there, it's gonna be hit and miss. Some people are gonna love it. Some people are like, what have you done? But that is the story of my life. I'll always do that, so I always split opinions. What, what color would you have chose? Do you want to say what's well, three? Satin chrome red, the turquoise you had. I like the aluminium blue you had as well, actually. The blue is a good shout. I do, I do like the blue. Um, but anyway, you'll find out. Size car and it is rubbing everywhere. I'm like, load your car. Yeah. Spacers. Yeah. I can just hear it going. Bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> the joys of, of doing crazy things to your car and just making it uncomfortable, bouncing down the roads. I've been in your car, I've been in Rio's car, the L's car. Um, so far, and everyone's right? car just bounce around. You just sit in the car and you're just like this. this is the worst. Um, when I went in L's car, his exhaust was blowing, so it sounded like I was in a <laughs> Formula One car, Formula One TT. <laughs> this, this is a lot more comfortable. This is a lot more comfortable. Audi, Lamborghini, same thing. <laughs> Say what? And we made it. Size driving um, is not, not the best. Oh, look at that noise. God, lift it, slowly. Like yeah. <laughs> not great, mate. It's not, it's not great. So I'm at Urban today um, to pick up my Range Rover. If you click here, you can see that video. But while I'm here, I thought, let me film for Yanni Monthly. Look at this car behind me. This is the brand new Cullinan done by Urban. In real life, it's, it's mind blowing. The carbon, the kit, it stands out. It's meaty, it's powerful. Really, I should get one of these, shouldn't I? In real life, this car, is, as Jamie would say, serious. You've got the brand new big boy wheel, 24 inch. Carbon absolutely everywhere. Spoiler, spoiler, rear, huge rear diffuser. Yeah, really, really nice. But yeah, it splits opinions, but let me know what you think at home. Oh, you're soft famous. So you up, mate. I don't want to do any cameras or any TV or any videos. Now look at you. Sigh, sigh from urban, mate. All right, boys, <laughs> Not my mate, some r coming to pick up his Range Rover, yeah? What, is Lenny coming? <laughs> Where's Lenny? <laughs> oh, you lot are out of order. <laughs> if you don't know who that is, that's Cy. He's the owner of Urban and godfather to my daughter. Hello, Lenny. Hello. How's the weather? I like the sunshine. The heat is killing me. I hate it. You really not? I really don't like it. Get I'm going to make two options. Yeah. I personally think it's too aggressive in the UK. The thing is, anywhere else around the world, people love it out there. In the UK, we're very, we don't embrace wealth. We don't like people doing well. We don't like things that are very out there. Look at me, look at me. Whereas you take that to America, Dubai, any other country, people are like, oh my God, that's incredible. But it was quite a shock to the system as well for urban customers, because urban is very much OEM plus, you know. And yeah. Our kits have always been fairly subtle compared to our competitors. Saying, so what you're saying, this is really urban. So, that, so <laughs> this, is, this is like, this is like quite, you know, brave for, for our usual, so what I plan to do, I'm not ignorant enough not to listen. When someone says, I like this, I like this, I like this, but I think if you'd have done this, you know, it would have gone. And if it, was only, if it was only two or three people saying that, but there was quite a few people saying, absolutely smash the back, wheels are lovely, looks great, the front, I'm not so sure. And people who would buy this sort of car as well, not just your average, like, Joe, yeah. Joe who watches YouTube, it's like, it's genuine feedback. But anyway, that is, the new urban Cullen. If you want to see these two jokers, yeah, you need to head over to their channel. Their channel is actually hilarious. Lenny, Lenny, stand up for you, innit? The channel. Stand up Between comedy. you and Cy, stand up comedy. It's not really stand up. It's, it's me and him having a couple of digs at a lot each of time other. We, a lot of time we are sitting down. It's banter. All the it's banter, <laughs> it's joke. I just spin down, sit, I just got sit, up. Sit, like, sit down comedy. That's sit down it's comedy. It's comedy. Yeah. No, I think it's a, it's a fine mix of nice cars and a little bit of banter. Ooh. Always looks better with the plate on. I'm known for ruining my cars and I'm chavvy and I'm so out there and he's probably gonna do it chrome and ruin it again and oh my God, money doesn't buy taste. One wrap which you have to admit to being a horrendous mistake. Do you know which one? Uh, snake skin. Yep. Range Rover Vogue Urban and I put snake skin Cream on it. snake skin. Yeah. And you touched it and it felt like snake Awful. skin as well. Horrible. It wasn't yeah. the best. Hand over done, you happy? I know it'll always be amazing. The wheel is in. Incredible. The car looks great. Just excited to get it back to the animals now. And ruin and it. Ruin it.
Are you hold it, but let's hold it. <laughs> it's not, it's not Mummy's makeup brush. Say hello. Hi. Hi. Oh, where, where's my sweetness? Where's my sweetness? There's my sweetness. Look. And say Mama. Say Mama. Say Baba. 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 Talking now. Talking now. It's grown up so much now. So we got that from Land Rover. Here, Fez. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> nice. You like Baba's new car? Give Obama. First, give Obama. Obama. So that is the end of Yanni Monthly. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And before you go, here's a quick teaser of what's coming next month. His name dropped Yanni Mike. Can you dress me up in sorry or something? Hands going Vegas. Chucked him off the table. Wait. Look who's here! We are not worthy! Oh my god! Is that, is that Matt Watson?